Its sharp teeth suggest Tyrannosaurus rex, but its claws, perhaps they say Velociraptor. Its size, something in between. This is in fact a new species of dinosaur altogether, but it is related to both Tyrannosaurs and Velociraptors. It also further links the prehistoric beasts to modern day birds, as paleontologist Fernando Novas explains. Pertenece a ese carril. It's part of a group that ends up with the origins of gigantic creatures like Tyrannosaurs and the others that aren't quite so big like the Velociraptor. And ultimately those feathered dinosaurs with long arms, but they're actually quite small. This means that the Bicentenaria is a distant ancestor that at the end of the bridge leads to birds. So we're seeing the great, great grandfather of birds. The Bicentenaria was unveiled by the Argentine Museum of Natural Science this week, a skeleton made up of 130 bones. Believed to be 90 million years old, it lived during the Cretaceous period when giant dinosaurs ruled the Earth.